question of, of can we end AIDS, that question has been asked and answered, and the answer is yes. The question is, will we do it? Uh, and, and, and in some ways, do we want to do it? That's the question before us. Uh, we have tools that have never been available to, uh, to us before. Uh, we have tools, enhanced tools around testing. We have enhanced tools around surveillance. Uh, we have enhanced tools around treatment. Uh, we have enhanced tools around prevention. We even have enhanced policy tools in the National HIV AIDS Strategy uh, and uh, the Affordability Care Act. Uh, so uh, the, the question is actually doing it, you know, making the investment that has to happen. The second point uh, that I wanted to make is that we really need, and I think the theme of this conference is critically important, uh, that we need both the science and the community uh, to work together to make, this, to make this happen. It's not an either or, it's an and and it's additive. Uh, and finally, you know, uh, from, from our perspective or from my perspective, you know, there are five things that we need to do in the AIDS epidemic. Uh, we need to fully implement the Affordable Care Act. Uh, that gives us 30 million people on care and treatment. It provides an essential benefits package that's critically important for people living with HIV. Uh, we need to create an environment where people living with HIV come out. That's critical. Uh, it's both for, for issues around stigma, but also around uh, creating demand. We need to have a system where we have treatment on demand. It's absolutely ridiculous uh, that, particularly in this country, the rich, richest country on, on, on the planet, uh, that we don't have treatment on de demand. Uh, and we need, to d we need to demand that treatment as a community. Uh, we need to integrate the treatment uh, and the science uh, with community. You, we can't do it alone. There's lots we've learned with our community-based organizations. Uh, and number five, we need to retool uh, our HIV AIDS infrastructure. Uh, many of our organizations are not currently equipped uh, to deliver the kind of services that they need to deliver in a post affordable affordable care act environment and in a in a post uh, biomedical intervention world